folks, thanks for coming on the line with us today. My name is John Dubas with Premier Marketing, and we'll be spending the next 45 minutes to an hour or so discussing the possibilities in the Medicare market with Blue Cross Blue Shield here in Texas. It's a, a carrier that if you operate in the state of Texas is one that really needs to be part of your portfolio. And folks in this neck of the woods, well, they were born with it, they live with it, and that's how they go. So we'll be spending the next 45 minutes or an hour going through some things and discussing the possibilities that you have in the different markets in the great state of Texas. Today's presentation is being recorded, and the link to the recording along with some additional follow-up material that we'll reference through the course of today's presentation will come to all those who have RSVP'd for today's webinar as well. We thank you for investing time with us today, and we'll go through some different things with you here very briefly. A bit of a overview on Premier Marketing. We are a national marketing organization founded in 1968. We're part of the Integrity Marketing Platform with offices across the country. We're an insurance wholesaler that offers contracts with major carriers through independent insurance agents, and those contracts come generally on a vested basis with the highest possible commission levels and recruiting contracts are available where appropriate. I mentioned we were founded in 1968. That means this past year we celebrated our 50th anniversary. It's a great milestone for a organization that began as a small family agency in a small town in rural Nebraska. And we've grown from that point in time to one of the larger largest producers in the Medicare Advantage space, leading several carriers um, in 2018 and 2019 production as well. This gives you an indication of some of the platform partners within the Integrity Marketing Organization. And you'll see right in the center there, that's us there at Premier Marketing out of North Fork, Nebraska. We do offer a full insurance portfolio, including all sorts of Medicare programs, Medicare Advantage carriers, med sub programs, and standalone Part D prescription drug plans, along with a full portfolio of life insurance and annuity plans, including final expense life insurance, pre-need programs, long and short-term care plans, disability income, and the ancillary benefit programs that are important to help people be financially secure with coverages for dental vision and hearing, critical illness and cancer programs, and hospital indemnity programs as well. That Medicare Advantage portfolio does include all the big boys across the country, including the one we speak with here today, and many of the smaller regionals that make a big difference in certain markets across the country. That same philosophy carries over into the PDP offering, where the standalone plans that you need are part of the portfolio that are avail that is available to you through Premier Marketing, along with a very robust Medicare supplement portfolio that gives you the opportunity to work with the carriers that are most competitive and supportive in your markets. That ancillary product portfolio, as I mentioned, has the major carriers in each of those categories for you, dental vision hearing programs, hospital indemnity and critical illness plans, and cancer programs as well. When we speak of the Medicare market opportunity, it is one of the details that is given to you by marketing organizations such as us and all of the major carriers where the baby boomers are aging into the market, over 10,000 people a day coming into the Medicare program based on age. And you can see the near exponential growth in this market um, projected through 2060. Many of us won't be around by then, but there's a certain large number of folks that are. And when you look at that and you think of the fact that Medicare also insures about a sixth of its total number for folks that are under the age of 65, you can really get your arms around the size of the opportunity that falls before us. And since we do operate as independent insurance agents, it gives us the opportunity to speak with folks, find out what their needs are, and address them properly through a diagnosis process that allows us to help them should they choose to stay in the original Medicare uh, administrative programs, 
supplement it with a Part D or look at the Medicare Advantage Part C programs that are an option, a very viable option for many on Medicare. The folks that are on Medicare, of course, as we mentioned before, do lay out into different age brackets, obviously, but about 16% of the Medicare population is under the age of 65, so that's a big part of it. And you have an increasing number of people enrolling in the Medicare Advantage programs, and that's one of the plan, uh, options that we'll spend uh, quite a bit of time on here today. That Medicare population also is in need of our services because of what's happening to them and to their wallet. The different chronic conditions that are suffered by many on Medicare, two thirds of that population, really emphasizes the need for complete coverage, as complete as possible, and a diagnosis to help people who can afford different types of coverages or who cannot, and how we can best address the issues that they face uh, in their retirement years. When we see people come into the Medicare population, they are coming now where it's almost an even split between Medicare Advantage and Medicare Supplement programs. Well, how's that work, John, when you said that a third of the population is on Medicare Advantage? Keep in mind that there's a number of folks that have group coverage or choose to self-insure as well. So it behooves us to have a portfolio of products that can address the entire Medicare population uh, and do our best job for those individuals. And those choices come with some key differences to us as agents. Obviously, there are different preparations we have to come into play with contracting and licensing to offer the different programs. The Medicare Advantage and Part D world have different enrollment periods than the Medicare Supplement world and different requirements when it comes to certification. Some of the things have changed too as to how we can address this population coming into 2019. The enrollment periods have changed. The MADP period, the Medicare Advantage disenrollment period went away and has been re replaced by the Medicare Advantage OEP period, which extends the first three months of the year, January, February, and March. So we've got 11 days left in OEP for 2019 and it is applicable only to certain individuals. It is applicable for folks who are already in a Medicare Advantage plan as of January 1st in order to use this particular switch period. It can only be used once during that time period and Medicare savings accounts, MSAs, and cost plans are not included in this enrollment period. As we mentioned, Folks have to be in an MA plan to take advantage of the OEP, and this gives them an opportunity to switch from one MA plan to another or to leave the Medicare Advantage world and go back to original Medicare with the possibility of coordinating a Part D SEP uh, so they can pick up a standalone drug program. It does not give them the opportunity to switch between one PDP plan to another but pick up a plan if their MA plan had drug coverage incorporated into it um, and gives them an opportunity to make certain that they maintain that coverage. It is not an extension of open enrollment during the annual election period, so an individual who's on original Medicare cannot join an MA plan based on this enrollment possibility. There are other possibilities that come into play, however, and that includes some of the different special enrollment periods that are commonly accessed throughout the rest of the calendar year moving forward. One of them that has changed quite a bit is the low income subsidy program, which has gone from a continuous program where a person could change each and every month to a one-time switch per quarter in the first three quarters of the year. This gives you a listing of some of the most common special election periods that are available to the Medicare population. I understand we're rolling through this pretty quickly, but as I mentioned, it is being recorded and you will receive that information along with special election period information from the National Council on Aging as part of the follow-up to today's presentation. One of the things that confuses people as well is if they are of Medicare age but are still working, how does this coordinate with the marketplace. 
two separate programs. We have a special training on that as well that you can access through this YouTube recording that will help you understand those differences and help the folks that are in that particular situation with it changing for them. Additional resources are available here as well, including the Bible for those of us uh, working with the Medicare market. Don't mean to be sacrilegious, but the Medicare and You Handbook has a ton of information on it, and you have different statistical details available from CMS here as well that can be very helpful for you. When we look at the portion of the Medicare population that is being addressed, their needs being addressed through Medicare supplements, the macro legislation does change the availability of certain Medicare supplements beginning next January in 2020. And this is the change that brings about the lack of an opportunity with no plan changes for new, not newly eligible individuals for Medicare supplements, plan C and F. They're not going away, but they are sunsetting for folks that are newly eligible. And this is a situation that we're going to address throughout the remainder of this year and obviously speak to it with startling regularity um, for the remainder of the time period before it comes into effect and as it comes into play. So a bit of a screenshot here for you for Medigap plans, giving you a comparison on a side-by-side -side basis with 2019 numbers as part of that comparison. You have an opportunity to go through and compare different Medicare plans through the quote engine available to our contracted agents. When you have a contract with Premier, you have access to the CSG quote engine made available through our organization without cost, and it gives you the opportunity to compare Medicare supplement programs, Medicare Advantage programs, um, hospital indemnity programs, final expense programs, and a fourth, fifth category that, boy, I, for the life of me, I can't think of it at this particular moment. I'm sorry, but we have an additional link that will come to you that speaks to how you can best use that program to work efficiently. Dental programs, that's the fifth. So today, we're going to sp be spending um, the next period of time with our, our friends from Blue Cross Blue Shield of Texas and discuss the possibilities that we have in the Medicare market in, in the great state of Texas. Our guest presenter is a longtime friend and a valued associate, Woody Key, with Blue Cross Blue Shield. He's the Medicare Regional Sales Manager based out of the Richardson office. And Woody, I'm going to turn it over to you. Just tell me when you want the next slide. Thank you, John. I appreciate it. We certainly appreciate everyone taking time today to join us. Um, and we want to uh, hopefully go through some opportunities that are available to you here in Texas. Um, go ahead and flip, John. This is the obligatory disclaimer that says it's proprietary information. And go ahead and change. Next. So I just do want to do a high-level overview of our parent company, Healthcare Service Corporation, or HCSC. We do have the Blue Cross license in five states, Illinois, Montana, New Mexico, Oklahoma, and Texas. You can see the impact that we have in Texas, a $1.1 billion economic impact. We have about 4.9 million members in Texas, and we have 6,000 employees uh, here in the state of Texas as well. I will say that this year, uh, John was talking about the uh, legacy of, of Premier. Blue Cross and Blue Shield of Texas will turn 90 years old this year. So as John um, discussed earlier, we are, many of our members have been uh, a Blue Cross member for most of their life and many for their entire working life. Next. Again, just to show you a quick glance at our market, the five markets that we're in, as you can see in Texas, we have, uh, this is the individual Medicare market. We have 277,000 uh, members in Texas, and 59% of that membership is in the Medicare supplement. So as John discussed, a 50-50 relationship, that's something we really wanna work on as far as 
moving up our membership for the uh, MAPD and the PD, the standalone prescription drug plan as well, to hopefully get closer to that 50-50 ratio. And again, remember in Texas, we have 4.9 million members. So only 277,000 are in the uh, Medicare arena right now. And we have a substantial growth opportunity as those members move off the uh, group plans and the commercial plans that we have in Texas. Next. Um, this is the agenda today, important updates. That's going to be really a duplication of what John just went over, so that won't take very long. We'll go through our MAPD benefits, our standalone prescription drug benefits. We'll talk about the Medicare supplement, uh, show you some marketing pieces, talk about our online enrollment, and then some resources again from producer services as well. Next. Next. Uh, John covered in great detail the restoration of the open enrollment period and that dual and LIS uh, can no longer change each month and the communications from uh, the marketing guidelines from Medicare. So I think that's all been covered in detail. Next. We did have three uh, changes in our plans this year. Again, most of this has already uh, transpired and been taken care of. Uh, the HMO Premier plans in Houston did not renew, and those members moved automatically to the HMO Basic. There was a POS, HMO POS plan in Houston as well uh, that the members had an SEP for and have moved to new plans. And then the Choice Premier PPO in Bear County, San Antonio, um, those members migrated to the Choice Plus PPO. So there's now only one PPO in Bear County, a zero premium PPO that we'll look at shortly. Next. Next. The we're, next few slides will talk about uh, value add benefits that are available to all of our members. The first of that is True Hearing, which is an exclusive hearing aid program that sells top of the line hearing aids at a guaranteed discounted price. Um, some of the HMO plans will have a hearing aid allowance that can actually be used toward this discounted price. This program offers 90 different models of hearing aids from five different leading manufacturers. Uh, every purchase includes three visits for fitting and training, 48 free batteries, uh, manufacturer's repair warranty for three years, 45 day money back guarantee, and a 95% customer satisfaction. Again, this is available to our MAPD members and our Medicare supplement members at no additional uh, premium, just as a value add. Next. Members also can access what's called Blue 365. That's a program to help our members live healthier lives by providing educational information and discounts on health and wellness products or services. Those discounts might include diet and weight control, elder care support resources, laser vision, and then each week there are weekly specials that are sent out um, as well. There's no claims to file, no referrals, and no additional fees to participate. So again, this is eligible for any of our MAPD members, our standalone uh, prescription drug plan, or our Medicare supplement members. Um, and it is a discount program that they're responsible for the discounted costs of. Next. Are MAPD members or eligible for a member rewards program? that provides gift cards to national retailers and grocers based on uh, the member completing specific health-related activities. A member can receive up to $100 in gift cards each year, uh, and it just puts money back in their pocket. The gift cards are available to Walgreens, Target, Walmart, Amazon, Albertsons, and many other uh, retailers as well. Next. So the qualified healthy activities that they can receive those gift cards for are a welcome to Medicare or an annual physical, and that's actually a $50 uh, gift card. The member does not have to do anything as the doctor files that uh, claim payment to us. Uh, it initiates the gift card to go out to the member. Uh, body mass index, $25 for an annual flu vaccine, uh, colorectal screenings, mammograms, uh, are all qualified health activities that will earn the member a, a gift card. 
Next. All of our MAPD plans do have silver sneakers on as a value added uh, to that plan. Again, silver sneakers has become more than a gym membership. It provides social events, health education seminars, as well as home exercise programs available to the member online. Uh, again, this is very well received. 91% of the participants responded that silver sneakers had improved their quality of life, and 65% of the participants reported that they had made new valuable friendships through silver sneakers. So it's become a much more than just a gym membership moving into the social uh, networks as well. Next. One benefit that we have for our MAPD uh, customers is a travel benefit, that if they're going to be um, gone for more than one week and less than six months, and they're gonna be more than 100 miles away from the service delivery area, they can call our member services department and they will set up um, in-network benefits wherever that member is traveling. So my mother-in-law lives, lives with me but three months of the year, she goes to Ohio. So she calls in, um, they will set up uh, for her to receive in-network benefits for her maintenance, uh, doctor's appointments in Ohio, and again, not have to pay out of network charges. So this can be used three times a year for the member. Um, and again, it has to be less than six months and uh, more than one week. It does not apply outside the uh, United States. However, members always have covered care for urgent care and emergency care worldwide. Next. Next. So we'll go through key selling points for each of the markets at this time. This particular slide will show up in front of each of the markets in Texas. So we'll just take a look probably at the provider portion on this this particular slide. Again, in Houston, they do have a robust network of providers for the MAPD, and they also have a P PPO plan in Houston. Uh, again, and you can see it all plans. Again, this would be for all plans statewide. The member rewards program is available. Uh, Blue Cross has 90 years of, of experience serving some Texans, and Silver Sneakers has included all the plans. Coverage for tier one medication through the coverage gap is included in all the plans, and transportation is included on some of our HMO plans that we'll take a look at as we move through. Next. So for Houston, we have the basic HMO, a zero premium HMO, and you can see the service delivery area of Chambers, Fort Bend, Hardin, Harris, Jefferson, Liberty, Montgomery, and Orange Counties. And we have two PPO plans in Houston as well, a $20 PPO and a $90 PPO. I uh, would point out that the $90 PPO does have some comprehensive dental coverage on it as well. Um, and the basic HMO has hearing aid allowance that again would could be used in conjunction with the true hearing discount uh, for the best value for the member. So, these sizzle sheets um, or the sheets like this will have available for each market. Uh, if you have questions or need copies of that, you can contact John uh, again, or I guess you'll have a copy of the recording, but he can put you in touch with, uh, get the sizzle sheets out to you or put you in touch with the regional sales manager of my counterparts in each of the markets available. Next. Uh, again, the key points for El Paso, again, you'll see this on all of them, 90 years uh, in business with Blue Cross, Silver Sneakers. Uh, but just roll down to the middle of the page there where the network is listed, uh, Epic IPA, uh, including WellMed, and some of the uh, network providers would be the important part uh, of each of these slides coming up in each of the markets. Again, the Silver Sneakers, the member rewards, and the 90 years uh, experience serving Texans will be uh, on all of these slides. Next. So for El Paso, we have a basic HMO, zero premium, and a value HMO uh, that are just available in El Paso County. Uh, you can see that the basic HMO is pretty, uh, uh, pretty rich in benefits. It does have uh, transportation included on that, 12 one-way trips per year. Um, 
and of course prescription drug coverage for tier one through the gap. Next. Uh, South Texas, again, if you look at the network, uh, over 500 PCPs, including the VOP network, uh, WellMed and independent providers, and I believe we do have all the hospitals that are available in South Texas as well, uh, and a hearing aid allowance, again, that can be used through the true hearing benefit. Next. Again, the basic HMO and the, the value HMO are available, and you can see the service delivery area is Cameron, Hidalgo, Webb, and Willisee counties. And then for the uh, value HMO, you can see the service delivery area for there, which also includes counties around San Antonio, including Bear County, and then also El Paso County as well. Uh, if you look at the basic, you can see that it is pretty rich benefits with a low $3,400 maximum out of pocket and a hospital inpatient of $350 per stay. So uh, very rich in benefits in those areas. Next. In Austin, again, I would just uh, encourage you to take a look at the networks that are available in Austin and the hospitals that are available in Austin. Uh, when you get this uh, recording back out to you uh, and take a look at the strength of our networks in the Austin area. Next. The basic HMO again is available in Austin. Uh, they also have two PPOs. They have a $20 PPO, the Choice Plus, and the Premier PPO at $90. Um, and again, on the $90 PPO, uh, comprehensive dental coverage is included with that as well. You can see the service delivery area of Bastop, Bastrop, Burnett, Caldwell, Fayette, Hayes, Lee, Travis, and Williamson counties uh, surrounding the area for the Austin service delivery area. Next. Uh, DFW selling points, again, take a look at the network, Texas Health Resources, Hospitals, and Physician Group. HCA, Medical City Hospitals and Physician Group, Dallas Methodist Hospitals, Dallas Methodist Physician Group, and John Peter Smith Hospitals, Clinics, and Physicians on the Tarrant County sign as well. Next. Two uh, PPO plans available in uh, the DFW area. You can see that our service delivery area for Dallas is Collin, Dallas, Denton, and Tarrant Counties. We do have a zero premium PPO uh, with preventive dental covered on that uh, particular plan as well. Uh, the prescription deductible is $415 for only tiers three, four, and five on both of those PPO plans. And again, prescription drug tier ones are covered, covered through the gap as well. Would also mention that on all of our uh, MAPD plans that uh, the insulin is a tier two uh, prescription drug uh, for uh, certain uh, certain insulins. So again, when you use the drug finder and you put in the insulins uh, necessary, uh, many times our MAPD plans will come to the top uh, as the plan of choice. Next. In San Antonio, again, they have uh, well-med physicians, an independent provider network, and all the major hospitals included uh, on the PPO plan with over 5,000 in-network providers uh, for the PPO plan. Uh, and again, Silver Sneakers, transportation benefits, and true hearing benefit available on those plans as well. Next. So again, in San Antonio, the value HMO is available, again, with a $4,000 maximum out of pocket. And then they have one PPO, a zero premium PPO, available in Bear County uh, as well. So again, two pretty robust plans available in the San Antonio area as well. Again, with all the, the same ancillary benefits that are available in the other markets too. Next. We'll talk a little bit about the standalone prescription drug, prescription drug plans in Texas. Uh, the, we have three plans in Texas. The value and the plus plans will have the same formulary. We do have a basic plan that has a separate and unique formulary. 
the basic plan has actually been uh, our very best plan uh, through AEP uh, with, with really tremendous results on that. Walgreens will be the preferred pharmacy in 2019. We do have some other preferred pharmacies, but on the basic plan, Walgreens is the only preferred pharmacy. Again, the initial coverage limit increased this year to 3820, and uh, the brand name prescriptions will be reduced to 25% in the coverage gap. Next. This is a quick glance at our uh, standalone prescription drug plans. You can see Texas is down there on the fourth line. Um, this actually shows all of our states. But we, the basic plan is $30.70. The value plan is $82.10. And then the plus plan is $140.10. Again, some additional preferred pharmacies are HEB in Central Texas, any Walgreens, Kroger, and some other local pharmacies. Um, as well as grocers are included as preferred uh, pharmacies in Texas. Next. This actually shows the copay again for, for all five of our states, or four of our states, Montana's not included. Uh, so if you find the Texas line, you can follow through that. Again, on the basic plan, there is a $415 deductible on all tiers. For the value plan, the deductible only applies to tiers three, four, and five, and then there is no deductible on the plus plan. And then uh, again, you can see the, the coverage gap information on that as well. And again, all of these sizzle sheets, or what we call sizzle sheets, these mock-up sheets um, are available to you uh, through our portal. Next. I take just a minute and talk about Medicare supplements. Of course, the member is free to choose any doctor that accepts Medicare. With our Medicare supplements, there are no enrollment or application fees. I know some of the carriers charge an application fee now. Currently, we have no gender rating uh, for male or female and no tobacco questions on the application. So it's really just one rate based on age. That may change in the future, but right now that's how it is. We also pay full commission on guarantee issue. Many of our um, friends and competitors uh, will pay you a, a flat amount or less on uh, guarantee issue products. Uh, our commission is the same uh, at full commission, whether it's a guarantee issue or an underwritten application. Uh, we do have attained rate changes at 67, 70, 75, 80, and 85, so it's not each year that they get an uh, age rated change. We have very few health questions on the application. That's actually our underwriting or the health questions. We only look back three years and we do not ask any prescription questions. The Medicare supplement is also available to enroll electronically through our Blue Access for Producers portal or BAP. And we'll show you in a couple of slides a rate stability chart that's really the key to selling Blue Cross and Blue Shield uh, Medicare supplement. Again, when you sit down with a client, um, I, don't, I want to dis disparage John's quote engine, but if you just pull out the Blue Cross and Blue Shield uh, application and start talking to them about Blue Cross and Blue Shield of Texas, uh, you're not going to run across many people that have not heard of Blue Cross and Blue Shield of Texas. You're probably not going to run across very many that have not uh, been one of our members at some point. And many of them that you run across will have been a member for their entire working life. That's how big our uh, commercial and employer groups are. So uh, again, it's just a, a real easy sale because of the reputation of Blue Cross and Blue Shield and how we do business in Texas. Next. There is an electronic sales kit available for uh, supplements. Uh, it will give you a uh, act, you just download it to your desktop. It will give you access to PDPs for everything you need to uh, sell a MedSup, including enrollment forms, outlines of coverage, uh, marketing pieces, uh, other disclosure forms and replacement forms are also available on that. So that can be downloaded from our uh, supply portal. Next. This is the rate stability chart that I was talking about for our Medicare supplements. If you just go back uh, five years or so to 2014, 
Uh, we did not have a rate increase. In 2015, we also had a rate hold. 2016, a 4.5% increase. 2017, a 4% increase. 2018, a 1.5% increase. And this year, we'll have about a 4% increase. Now, again, this is across all plans. So as you drive down based on uh, the area rating in the plan, whether it's FG, N, or whatever, those rates may be a little bit higher or a little bit less. Uh, I can tell you that typically our area two, which is the metro areas, um, has for plans F and G has run significantly less than those uh, noted increases right there. So again, you can sell with confidence that you're not gonna have a tremendous rate increase um, as some companies may have with when they come in with predatory pricing. So. Thank you very much. Uh, John, next slide, please. We also have an electronic sales kit available for the uh, MAPD. Uh, it provides interactive PDFs. It will also pro provide ancillary benefit flyers, decision guides, enrollment forms, uh, roadmaps, plan comparison charts, trifolds, and summaries of benefits. So again, this is something that you go to our supply portal you download to your desktop, and it is available to you uh, at that point to uh, access any of those forms that you may need. It's also available for the PDP as far as formularies, uh, pharmacy director, provider directory, uh, and other things such as that. Next. We do still accept paper applications, although we would prefer that you'd use the electronic uh, method to submit your applications. If you do use paper, please be sure you print clearly. Make sure your information is accurate, that your agent number is correct. Include any forms that may be appropriate, and please fax only one application at a time. Uh, no cover sheets required. And always submit your applications within 24 hours of the signature. Next. There are also marketing kits available on the uh, supply portal. This is an example of a trifold that's available for you. You could use this in physician's offices as well as grass, 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 grassroots marketing. I'm getting a little tongue-tied here. Grassroots marketing. Uh, those can be ordered. You can uh, imprint your imp contact information on them and use them for any of those type of activities that you do in the uh, community. Next. Next. So also on our provider portal, there's a resource tab. Under this resource tab, there's a new agent reference guide. This guide will provide links to the provider finder through the to the formulary, ancillary services, scope of appointment. It also talks about enrollment periods, the member rewards uh, assistance, how you can help members with that. Uh, it has Medicare marketing guidelines and critical training reminders on it. So I would encourage you again to go to the supply portal and be sure you access that agent reference guide with the hot links to help you uh, work with your members. Next. This is the supply portal. It is yoursupplyportal.com. That's where the electronic sales kits are available. That's where you can order the regular sales kits as well. Uh, any supplies or marketing uh, materials would be available through this supply portal. So would encourage you to, once you're contracted, certainly hit that link and see what's available to you as far as marketing materials. Next. Uh, we also have a, a link to take you directly to the provider finder and the drug finder. It is getbluetx.com slash MAPD. So it's just a, a quick link that'll take you right to those uh, online uh, formularies, online provider finders, online drug finders, where you can enter your prescriptions for the member uh, and tell them exactly what their cost will be uh, on an annual basis and on a monthly basis, 
if they hit the gap, it'll show when they hit the gap and what they pay for the prescriptions in the gap as well. So again, getbluetx.com slash MAPD. Next. So that pretty much concludes my portion of the presentation. That's my contact information. I do have counterparts in each of the markets. We have Fernie Archuleta in El Paso, uh, Victoria Trevino in Austin, Daisy Barrera in San Antonio, and Don Muir in Houston. Uh, and again, if you need to get in contact with them, John can help you uh, get their contact information and uh, reach out to them and they'll, they will help you with any questions that you have regarding each specific market. So with that, John, I appreciate your time. Thank you very much for everybody that joined and I will turn it back over to John DeVos. Awesome, Woody, thank you. One question that came through the queue uh, is looking for availability of coverage in Abilene. Could you tell us what uh, Blue Cross Blue Shield has in that part of the, our great state? Yeah, in Abilene, we would just have the Medicare supplement and the standalone prescription drug plan uh, available. We do not have an MAPD in the Abilene area. And Richard, I'll send you a diagnosis of some of the, the options that you have. But uh, to Woody's point, the Blue Cross Blue Shield program, one of the things that we do, and Woody, you didn't disparage the quote engine, is <laughs> using that tool as a reason for why a carrier prices their programs the way they do, and we realize that many folks that are on Medicare are of a conservative nature and are looking for stability in their rates throughout not just a six-month period or a year, but in a longer time frame as well. So depending upon your explanation of some of those programs that are available, it could be a real selling point for a large, stable organization such as Blue Cross Blue Shield. So I thank you, Woody, for your time and uh, the information. One of the things that we want to go through very quickly, additional oh, I forgot about that. Bullet. Yeah, that <laughs> protects our uh, trademarks and so forth, so that's good. Thank you very much. That's, yep, that's the CYA <laughs> uh, slide, so we'll take care of right. that. One of the reasons why you'd want to do a business with Blue Cross Blue Shield through any particular organization depends upon some of the support material and support programs available from that organization. We'll spend just a little bit of time doing so uh, now with uh, some detail from Premier. As you look at different programs and you look to contract with multiple organizations, we do have a software package that allows you to create an agent profile and autofill contracts on a electronic basis. Um, certain carriers will have electronic means directly to the carrier that simplifies and speeds up that process for some of the big boys. And Blue Cross Blue Shield is one of those organizations. They're working through a change in the contracting system right now. Um, so we anticipate even a larger improvement in the, their contracting process, but it's something that we can do across the board to help you electronically. Uh, as independent agents, many times an agent chooses to contract with multiple organizations, and some of the brethren that we have in the community do offer blanket programs, but it only covers the programs that are contracted through that organization. This is an errors and admissions program offered at a discounted rate that allows you coverage on all the programs that you offer, regardless of who that contract is through. Very reasonable rates, uh, very easy to work with, and if uh, a technically inept individual such as myself can actually work, the, work this program. It's simple to use as well. We do also make means available to you to make certain that your contract is available because you're licensed in a particular state. And for those who are not grandfathered in this circumstance, uh, we offer discounted continuing education through our relationship with WebCE as well. We do offer also a unique way to protect your income. As an independent agent, you will have to maintain your own benefit package. And this is a non-cancelable disability income program available for our contracted brokers at a discounted rate and with a shared commission on your own product and a limited underwriting uh, 
piece as well. We do offer additional training programs, not only carrier specific, but also conceptually based that help you with different marketing approaches, uh, including a way to map out your target area and deal with the centers of influence within that community. Uh, many of these have been recorded and are available to you through uh, links on our website. We also have this on a singular piece that we're going to send out as part of the follow-up to today's presentation. We have regularly scheduled live webinars as well, but sometimes your schedule and our schedule are two different animals, and this is a great way for you to access a lot of the information 24-7 as you choose to do so. We do offer extensive electronic support as well. Many of the carriers do offer electronic enrollment now. Uh, Blue Cross Blue Shields program is a, a very stellar example of that, but we do also offer uh, different quote engines and enrollment devices, including our Medicare Center program and a program through our quote engine with CSG that allows you to do an enrollment process through that device as well. So it's a really neat combination of options available to you. Depending upon how many carriers you work with, some of these can be a, a great means of comparison um, or also a singular source of doing it. But as Woody mentioned earlier today, uh, the carriers in the know have their own systems as well. And it's something I would really strongly recommend that we become accustomed to and utilize. Back in the days when Woody and I worked together many years ago, sorry, Woody, I'm dating us, uh, back in the Evercare days, the applications that came in through that organization, over 80% of them were pended. And the main reason was not necessarily incomplete applications, but was a challenge of reading the language that we wrote on, with on that application. Most of us use Chickenese instead of English or Spanish or whatever other language that uh, is readily recognizable and uh, translatable. So using an electronic means not only helps the application go through the process much more quickly, but it also enables us to put the coverage in place and on a timely basis to help the peace of mind of our prospects and clients. It also gets us paid sooner as well. We do have a program that allows you to put your social media marketing uh, efforts on autopilot as well through our Coverage Made Easy program. There are uh, recordings of uh, the uh, process that is involved with that uh, on this slide as well. We do offer a full range of incentives, including not only information on uh, incentives and trips available through the particular carriers, but our own producers convention. Um, the Medicare Advantage and prescription drug programs are not part of these programs because of the government stipulations on compensation, but Medicare supplements most certainly are, and Blue Cross Blue Shield offers you a very strong option to help with qualifications for that trip through their program. We are headed to Jamaica this year, and next year's trip is about to be announced, so stay tuned for that. We do offer lead support for you as well. If you are one of those individuals who has a fond relationship with Ma Bell, we can create contact list custom ordered for you at either a deeply discounted price or as deeply discounted as you can get without cost to you based on contracting with our organization. We have different training programs as well and, and systems set up to help you with grassroots marketing campaigns, the gift that keeps giving. Um, some of the carriers also give you an opportunity to work prospects generated through their marketing efforts. I know Blue Cross Blue Shield during this past AEP was a strong advocate of helping the agents that help them. It's one of those partnership deals where you go with your hand out uh, to shake a person's hand as, as opposed to getting it filled. Working with them helps qualify you for those assistance programs. We are pioneering and test driving some internet lead programs that are going to be rolled out in the Medicare world here very shortly. And we do offer direct mail support as well based on uh, production, deeply discounted rates that allow you to access thousand piece mailers through our preferred lead vendors. We do that simply because it helps us with uh, compliance and the letters 
that are available for this program. A great way for you to do some things consistently through direct mail. Uh, kind of like the old Monty Python movie, they're not dead yet. Direct mail still works and is part of an overall marketing program. All this said, we do all this because we want your business and we look forward to the opportunity of working with you. We will be doing some follow-up, as I mentioned, to today's presentation, presentation, including emails coming to you with the recording of today's presentation and additional uh, reference material as we noted through the presentation, and that will come to you in the next day or two. And what then becomes your responsibility is looking at the different options that are available to you, look at the strengths and the advantages that come to you by being a contracted Blue Cross Blue Shield agent, integrate it into your personal marketing program, get contracted, study, make certain that you're actively marketing and moving forward. That said, you can reach any of the marketers with our organization through the toll-free number of 1-800-365-8208 or through our website at premiersmi.com. Um, we look forward to the opportunity of visiting with you and make certain that we can take care of any individual questions that may vary that have come through um, today's presentation. So when you look at different compensation and commissions of the different policies, that information will come to you as part of the follow-up based on your circumstance. So that said, once again, thank you for the investment of your time on today's webinar. Mr. Key, we thank you for your participation and your help, as always. Um, Woody is an invaluable resource in North Texas and throughout the state, as he's demonstrated today, a good friend and a good individual um, and we thank you again, Woody, for that. That said, we wish you a productive remainder of the day and good selling to you. Thanks so much, and we'll talk to you soon. Thank you, John. I appreciate it. Thanks, Woody.